actually. It's, this is what we're seeing here is pretty much exactly as was delivered, yeah. except for the changes to the workstations, the reuse the lay, workstations, the lay, layout around the corner here. Mm -hmm. That changed a little bit, um, but we've got the member lounge sitting in it. Um, <laughs> the workstation run is exactly the same. Um, I think even your furniture layout. So. Yeah, the furniture layout's almost identical. Isn't that great? Amazing. Yeah. I mean, given that we only had 12 weeks though, yeah, from yeah. beginning to move in, yeah. it's probably a good thing that we know of the plan pretty Absolutely, early. absolutely. <laughs> it's very true. And, um, and what about the concept board? Wow, it's really amazing looking at these again. How long ago was this? It must have been October last year. We had all the staff in your office all kind of cutting out these fantastic images of interior spaces to inspire them um, as to what their new um, office was going to be like. And we run these sessions with most of our clients and it really gives us an insight into who they are. Mm -hmm. And I knew most of your people, <laughs> but they were just so dynamic and creative and out there in that session. It was gorgeous. And I think when you look at these images, you're right, there are lots of ideas here that they brought to the table that we've used. But I think the other thing that came out of it is just the vibrancy of the group mm. and that then translates into an energy in the space. We've come from this really enclosed environment, little office, really small group of staff. And we've never really had that consciousness of being open to the public. And now that we've grown so much and we've got this really wonderful um, showcase space that we want to show off, it's, like, it's the opportunity for the staff to kind of get into that headspace as well. So. Yeah, I look, I think there was real value as well in engaging the staff in this process because it's allowed them to see the way a design process works mm. and how the tool interacts with it. Mm. And it's just been gorgeous having Jo and Sonia involved all the way through, mm. as well as the rest of you, mm. to be able to see the reality of working with the tool, for them to be able to understand a design process and how decisions are made, where the tool affects different decision making. It's, I think it's been invaluable. Mm. What we're, what we're doing is the right thing in terms of the environment. So when we wash our hands in the basin um, and when we um, wash our dishes in the sink, the water's being reused and there's a no guilt feeling in this office, which I think is personally something um, I really enjoy having and I know a lot of our staff do as well. The other greatest thing about this office is we've got something that people can come to and they can actually physically see and touch what is a green office interior fit out and it's something we've proven can happen in an existing building. So for anyone out there saying what do we need to do with our existing buildings, come and visit us, come and see our new office space. We've done it, we've achieved it, we worked with the owner of the office and we've done some pretty amazing things but you know what, they're nothing new, it's old technology and we've done it on a budget. <laughs>